Hey, it's me, MaxX5, and I'm here to show you a video tutorial about making an engine, how it works, and also how you will be able to, I don't know, power something. <laughs> so first, engines are made to produce energy, and energy are used to, like, propellers, uh, even cannon, uh, you know everything that could be powered like uh producers uh, i mean amo producers uh air pumps uh, resource uh, gatherer uh, wild drill anything like that you know and uh here we got uh, some some complicated example oh damn nike you son of a fish Oh yeah. So sorry for this little night of like twenty second. Thank you, son. Uh yeah, so here we got the very powerful engine or I could say very powerful cylinder which is one only one but produce a lot of lot of energy. And here we've got a simple engine with a cylinder that produce a lot of energy but way less than this uh, I mean if it could be 8 piston or cylinder so first let's teach how to make an engine first of first you need an, an, an engine block sorry and this engine block is like it, it's like the transmission of a of a real engine but uh, how could I say it? It's like if it's it's took from the uh, take this connect it to uh, your fortress or even ship or plane or anything, and it's like if it's it was the energy transmitter. So l let's get to less complicated thing. Uh, yeah. The crankshaft is like the real engine block of a real engine. If you put it there, it is like if it's the outside of a it's the block and inside there is a crankshaft. And for the more simple engine you can make, you just could make a piston like this and then a carburetor which should be anywhere around the piston and the piston could be anywhere around it like here so yeah so I usually prefer to do it like this and then you need an engine fuel tank which I prefer to put it here and it must be connected to the carburetor so here we've got a functional engine as you can see the piston is moving not really not a lot but it's moving not compared to the other one which are like uh, <laughs> sorry so to produce more power you've got the supercharger and the exhaust which will produce a lot more power the supercharger will uh, will add more air to the engine which will um, make a uh, fuel go I don't know how to explain it but you know it's it's engine thing and you've got the exhaust which will make l consume less fuel also it will give you a lot of power and uh, here we've got the connectors and connectors are gonna be uh, are gonna be here or I, I for the moment I just know that you can do this and this and this is the principal use for it then you put your cylinder over here and it work also if you want to uh, to power them you just got to put the carburetor here and a fuel tank always attached to the carburetor then our piston works if you want them to work even more wait a bit if you want them to work even more just got to put exhaust anywhere around the piston so it could be on top, it could be on this side, it could be on this side 
and only if it's touch, but it doesn't work down of it. I, I don't think they didn't test because it don't really got sensed. So if you see for a basic piston the power projection is two with only a carburetor and you know the basic. Then if you I put an exhaust it get up to three. Then if I put a supercharger it get up to seven. And this is for them too because they are both attached to this uh, carburetor. So how could I get it more than seven is by putting more supercharger and exhaust. Like if I put another uh, PS PS I mean if you want a uh, supercharger can only be attached to carburetor like I could put it here and it will be good you see it's 11 power projection if I put it near the piston it will be nothing so if you put it here you've got more and if I get another exhaust I'm at 7 and I put an exhaust I come at 10 and also it give me more fuel uh, it it uh, consume less fuel so this is where how you can make a basic engine like this and this is a really basic engine why are days and nights so court thank you so here it is I don't need that for sure and I don't really need that too like I could do this but uh, I don't know I prefer this way because it look like a V engine you know V8 like this one you got the piston exhaust I don't consider them exhaust but they are supercharger 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 and you got the fuel tank on the side of the um, the carburetor to give them fuel each so that the uh, the piston have the most power you can give them and then you've got here the most powerful engine you can make so you see I'm making a maximum power of 50 and to be sure of that I can go here and show you that my piston produce 46 and it consume 0 0.09 which is small because it have a lot of you know it have four exhaust around it if I get out some I will lose power and I will lose uh, I will get more uh, more fuel it, it will take more fuel to operate and here is how I do my engine you might know how to make uh, how to make it only by looking at it but I'll show you here it is first sure you make an engine block you make an engine block because that's the way engine are made and here I'm gonna make a 8 cylinder engine then you place left right to up connectors which will make your piston work it's like if the, this the crankshaft is connected to this and this give the crankshaft to the piston and so that's how it work then take the carburetor put it here so now it kinda look like a real engine and it's also like in real engine then if you want to make the basic just make fuel like if you just started your your kind of campaign you know what I mean like that you have resources and all this thing you and you are poor you can simply do that and produce energy as you see it work because it got fuel carburetor and camshaft and a motor and as you see I'm producing 25 but I want more than this and as I got the resource I'm gonna do this like this 
So, like a real engine, you're gonna put your exhaust here. Or you could say your manifold, like in real. Then, if I see at my engine, it now have a maximum output of 37. But I want more, so put more exhaust. Then, put some supercharger. But first, let's see how am I. I am at 50, and now my fuel fuel per power is age, which is the fuel consumption, is 0 0.0029, which is not really a lot. You put some here, just like if you would compress the gas in the carburetor, like in real life. And then, I put some here. And so, that's how it should be done. For more, for even more energy, because you see, I'm now at 201 of energy, not 37, which is a lot, and my power consumption is really low. So, if I want even more performance, uh, I mean, you know, I just, just do that. As you see, you've got even more space. Look, I've got a carburetor which it can be even more powerful so I put it here put it here do the same on the other one then oh look I have some piston with no exhaust or kind of put it here put it here and then put it there if you see I'm now at 284 which is 80 more than what I was it's not a it's it's a lot it's really a lot. So, if you want to make a really, really powerful engine, you've got my simple piston. Or, I mean, the simple piston. You could call it a caterpillar even. Look, it made 46 of energy for one piston. And the power consumption is so much none that it's it's hybrid. It's It's not even fuel using. So let's do that like this. You put your cylinder. Then you put your carburetor. Then put your fuel tank. I like to put it this way. So then just do the same as the other one. You click there, click there, click there, click there. Then put the exhaust so that the engine really don't cost a lot just like this so now I've got two piston only two but do you wanna see the power that this make wait a sec so see I was at 46 and ah I mean it's 246 but it was like 53 or something like that and now I'm at 106 106 for two piston I've got eight, 8 here and 8 there and I'm making 284 so put 4 I mean 8 of them put 8 and you're gonna give yeah sure you're gonna have a f damn long engine but put 8 and you've got 380 kind of energy you're gonna produce this is amazing seriously and this is it I think don't think I got something more gonna show you uh, nope so this is how it worked hope uh, it helped you and hope you gonna make maybe something even better and see you next time bye